content internship in electric vehicle part and software division so basically the rounds were olt and interview olt con consists of mcqs from electrical domain and also uh, some uh, uh, mental ability kind of questions other than that in uh, in the olt round we also had uh, uh, two coding questions and uh, in the interviews they ask questions in electrical domain and coding domain too so uh, in the apsw basically we worked in the electrical software part in the internship so during my intern i was given responsibility to develop a two stage onboard charger so uh, this is something related to charging in ev technology so i was is responsible to completely uh, make a software control software for the charging part so this was my responsibility and i need to complete this task within 2 months of my internship what i never made my resume thinking of the i need to uh, secure some internship or full time uh, with my resume so uh, coming to project part first so i made project uh, with my club robo sm initially i was part of uh, mechanical engineering department uh, in my first year of study so i made projects in mechanical first then i switched my stream to electrical engineering then i made few projects in electrical engineering uh, got some knowledge participated in hackathons got achievement so somehow when you are involved in the college you uh, get projects get get achievements get in internship opportunities somehow project internship everything uh, get collected and you get a good resume if you are involved okay so coming to electrical part first so uh, the course of the study that we get to academics in our college is uh, enough and we should practice few questions from mcq websites are there so uh, once we practice them um, study the uh, pdfs and the study material provided by the professors in the college study so it's enough for the electrical part and uh, i used to uh, give few contest uh, in code forces and coaches so i got knowledge of uh, coding questions from there so for the jlr part these two things are very important so i got knowledge for control system from the uh, control system and parallel electronics from college academics and coding from the coding contest yes. so i started when i got shortlisted in olt that's the best time you get into pressure and you start to prepare for that this is ideal time answers to many of the questions asked by the interviewer so uh, my approach would be ki uh, do not try to give vague answers or just try to fake your answer just uh, tell whatever you know about that tell your approach to that answer but if you don't know just tell them ki uh, i don't know that answer and i am not very confident in this topic or i am not very confident in this question so don't give the vague answer because they actually know uh, if you are confident enough or not That's they just check the confidence I cannot give you advice, but uh, if you don't want, don't take advice from my side in this question. But uh, I usually uh, prioritize things. For example, if uh, interview is coming close, then I'll prioritize on studies. If I'm uh, feeling like I don't have anything to work, uh, I just go out to restaurants and you know where. So I just waste my time there. <laughs> you know in the core sector uh, there are there are enough opportunities if you see the number of student applying to that means uh, the number of people at, uh, actually genuinely applying are not uh, too much so if you are uh, genuinely working hard in the uh, core field then you can easily get uh, internship and full time opportunity in core especially in electrical domain great experience uh, it's a uk based firm so actually uk based firms are quite chill and uh, actually it's a iit only kind of company so uh, all the mentors managers are kindly uh, kind of iit and so all of them uh, know how the experience should be in uh, internship so they provide you great platform to explore the field 
Yeah, and I had a great time with my team and uh, also with the alumni. So I some alumni were uh, there in the uh, JLR charging division. So I enjoyed with them. I had uh, outings with them, with the team, mentors, managers, everyone. So it was great experience. Three month experience was it. during the internship there is no crucial moment kind of thing you actually need to work continuously during your internship uh, time period and uh, you need to show dedication to your manager actually he, you are working hard towards your project and uh, you need to ask doubts if you have you just need not to sit and uh, waste your time there if you are given an opportunity to work in a firm so dedicate your time towards the company and if they find that you are uh, working in a good manner, you are dedicated towards the towards the project. So they'll definitely give you the PPO. There's no any chance that they'll reject you. If you say POR in your resume. That doesn't make any sense to write a number of PORs in your uh, resume. Uh, the interviewer don't see that part ki how many PORs you have. But uh, the important thing you get through POR is uh, the experience, the learning experience that you get. So uh, when I got admitted to this college, I have I had very less knowledge in uh, building relations with the people, getting experiences. Uh, in the field of core and software field but as I got POR in clubs, fest and all so uh, I gained experience, soft skills uh, that's the most important thing I, I genuinely think if you are uh, working hard in college and uh, if you are getting some PORs in college you should have a, a good set of soft skills so getting uh, learning soft skills is very important through PORs number of PORs doesn't make sense in uh, the CV first year student then I would say ki, uh, go out explore clubs explore hobbies what you can uh, get in college ticket uh, experience camp in sector colleges explore karo, uh, explore everything uh, all types of technical clubs cultural clubs everything uh, means uh, try to meet as many people as you can during your course of study uh, what you learn in the college life is basically how to interact with people that is more important than what you gain through academics so uh, for me, soft skills is having higher weightage than your uh, academic learning. So I focus on that more. So uh, that experience is very important. The important uh, advice jo hai, ki don't sit big in the hostel room and don't waste time in the hostel room. Go out, explore, college explore. Karo. मतलब फर्स्ट ईयर सेकंड ईयर में तो अच्छा ही लगता है कॉलेज एक्सप्लोर द कॉलेज एंजॉय करो चिल काटो बाहर घूमो जो जो कर सकते हो सारे क्लब्स एक्सप्लोर करो इफ यू नो टाइप्स ऑफ क्लब तो सब चीजें एक्सप्लोर करो घूमो ट्रिप्स करो ट्रैवल करो मतलब जितना एक्सपीरियंस गेन करोगे उतना दिमाग चल रहेगा उतना बढ़िया करियर जाएगा मतलब करियर से ज्यादा लाइफ में चिल करना इंपॉर्टेंट है